What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Spanko here with Victor and uh, we wanted to show off a, a list that he put together. So what you were mentioning last week at Locals, you had come second place. Yeah, I came second place and I forgot like two cards in the deck. Yeah. <laughs> Which and then was funny. Was you hilarious. updated it now. Yes. And it's an Orcus list. It's an Orcus list. With uh, oh, yeah. Spice according to you. Yeah. It's spicy as heck. And uh, how do you feel about the deck? Uh, I like it. It's, uh, it's somewhat resilient to draw. Uh, because the mere fact that, you know, dump everything to grave, yeah. summon from grave. Uh, Galatea set places, sets instead of adding, uh, which makes it very, very convenient. Uh, you know. So I have one question before we get into the profile. Hit it. Did you get hit with a Bastille on Harpoor today at all? Uh, yes. Yo, oh, so yes. you, f you felt the pain. He did it. No. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Only only game that I lost today. The only game you lost today. Only game that I lost today. All right. So uh, let's get right into the profile. All right. So cool. first off, we got uh, three Nightmare. Of course. Uh, you know, combo starter. Uh, dumps the best card in the deck. This one. Of course. <laughs> of course. His place in the ban list was deserved, 100%. Uh, you know, one one of them, because we only can play one, otherwise we will play more. Uh, two Skellies. Uh, Skellies is very important when, you, when you're looking at imping, what do you call it? Uh, interactions during your opponent's turn, as long as you have Babel, of course. Uh, actually quick effects if they're supers without the field spell. The, damn it, I need those sons. <laughs> you need the supers. I need the supers. Uh, then we got uh, one Brass Bombard and, and one Wand. Okay. Uh, the Bombard is for those hands where you open like Bombard plus Nightmare. Yep. And that's the only thing that you can do. You use normal, normal Bombard, link into Link Aribo, and and play from there. Okay. Right? Like... I've used it twice, maybe, but it's I rather have it and not need it than need it and not have it. Not have it, yeah, cool, cool. Makes sense. So then, so that's the monster. That's all the Orcus monsters. Then yep. we have uh, one Babel, uh, one Return, one Crescendo. Standard. Yeah, I I might play two Crescendo. Oh, why two Crescendo? Uh, so I've noticed that if it's weird, if I don't open it. More often than not, I'm not setting it. Because you get into Babel, right? Because I get into Babel. Yeah. But if I play two, I have more chances of opening it. That makes sense. Which, you know, another layer of interaction. Okay. I, I gotta try, I gotta test it out. I gotta test it out. Okay. I'm not sure yet. So that's for that. Then we got returning from the from the annals of history, the PKs. Okay. <laughs> that's like so, a throwback list. Yep. So we got, uh, you know, uh, we got boots, we got cloak, and we got, of course, Two fog blades. Yep. Uh, the end board, it's you know the the one that we did in toss format. Yeah. Uh, Rusty plus IP plus Kelly engrave and and, and the two traps. fog blades. Yeah. More often than not, that's it's enough. enough. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So then we go for the actual spice. Okay. Um, this deck doesn't have a very good normal sound. No. I mean it does in in gear suit, but I don't have it. Because it's spiked up. Uh, so, what's the next best, best thing? Something that allows you to discard cards. Okay. So we go for the for the adventure package. So we get to play three three right, three enchantress. We play the Draco back, the adventure, and the Griffin Rider. Yep. Now, that's the normal package that everyone plays. It's solid. There is an issue. If you go second, if you go second. Griffin Rider doesn't do much. Yep. You play Legal Knight. Okay. And Legal Knight in the main deck you felt was fine? I, I, yeah. I play Andrew and in game two I won it because I was playing Legal Knight. Oh, okay, okay. Otherwise I wouldn't have won. Okay, that makes sense. And finally, ah, uh, these cards are so dumb. Ah, uh, the Horus cards. They're so dumb. I love it. Yeah. <laughs> so we got three in SETI because hell yeah. Uh, three Sark because again same same ex same explanation yep. and one a piece of all the other ones. Yeah. So you're using these just literally as discard fodder. Uh, discard fodder and uh, of we go into the extra deck. The zombie vampire is there, so okay. So it's you know it's discard really from the hand and then zombie vampire mills four. Uh, I sold in Fenrir like four times. It's wow. very funny. Yeah, it's good. Because uh, yeah, uh, then we got a couple of one offs. Uh, 
The warrior stuff. The warriors, the dark warrior stuff. Uh, this is more, you know, gen Honorary general center. utility. General utility, yep. Uh, but Greffer, we have eight, I believe, eight targets that we can use for Greffer. So Greffer is solid. Also, yep. discards a card from your hand. Uh, Armageddon Man is the only one that might conflict. Because of the adventure engine? Correct. But it's a one, one off. Yeah, it's, it's a one off. Yeah. If you know open adventure, you can also mill it with uh, something vampire and summon it back, and then you got another monster, right? Yeah. In which I did it, and I think it was uh, round three, I think. Yep. I did that. Uh, solid cards, very solid. They they all deserve to be in the ban list, in the, in, the, in the limited list. And finally, we got the board breakers. Yep. So. Oh, so no hand traps. No hand traps. Okay. Hand traps are bad. I'm, I'm joking. Hand traps are not bad. I want to discard cards. Oh, yeah, that's also fair. Droplet's good. I, droplet's good. This gives me two cards. Yeah. Or allows me to steal a monster. That to Andrew, I stole his... Uh... Yeah, you're just getting targeted today. Yeah. Well, yeah, I lost to him. So, he's the only, yeah. he's your only loss. Yeah, this is my only loss. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so... Andrew Slender. Yeah. So, basically, I stole uh, his, feel, his fears. Yep. And, and I normal summon, I believe, Skelly. And went into uh, Longirsu. Yeah. Longer, so? The uh, three, right? yeah, the link three. Yeah, he had beast. Yep. He had burned the beast, but could not use, utilize it on my Dingirsu because his monster was linked to my to, to, to Longirsu. Long so, and then I just shuffled uh, so from some of his stuff. All right, so taxes is good. Then. So yeah, uh, board breakers. Is it forty cards? Uh, forty three. Forty three. Forty three. Okay. Okay. Forty three. Okay. So well, that's the main. Uh, I like it. Uh, if I could change something from it. Uh, Another harp, but I can't, so... <laughs> yeah, yeah, maybe one day, maybe one day. Maybe one day. All right, so we're going to the extra now. Yep. Uh, one zombie vampire. Of course. For the uh, horse, horse yep. for the horse card. Uh, two Dengirsus. Uh Funny enough, I pulled this card during New Year's. Uh, my buddies were doing a game, you know, throw balls into yeah. the things. And... Uh, I have bought a couple of packs of uh, ready, collection. Uh, ready collection. So I won one of those and I pulled this. I told my buddy, it's a sign. It's a sign. It's a sign. It's a sign. So, so yeah, we're here because of the sign. So those three. Uh, last game, uh, funny enough, instead of making Zombie Vampire first, I made this. I was playing Sorcel and I made this before I did anything else. Yep. And his uh, blackout was dead. Okay, yeah, that's fair. Right? Because it's protection. It's protection. Exactly, yeah. yeah. There are people people think that it's just the one card, but nope, it's everything. Yep. Uh, two Galatea. Honestly, I think that two is not enough. I will up this to three as soon as I can find it. And that's what we play two long gears. Are you going to go three and one later? Yeah, three and one. Three and one. I think the three and one is the right play. I, I barely summon long gears because the way that the, the, the loop works. Yeah. Uh, you more often than not won't have the two yeah. to do it. So, yeah. Okay. So yeah, those are the the ones. Uh, then we have a bunch of one-offs. Rusty Tin Can, IP, Mascarena, Unicorn, uh, Dark. Yep. It's really good. Uh, Access Code, uh, Link Aribo, Typhoon, and... Uh, Zeus. Zeus. It's the only card that is not dark in the extra deck. Yep. Yeah. Did you ever make it today? Uh, I almost had an opportunity. You will probably see it in the match. Okay. Uh, but uh, I was locked into dark, so I'm like, so whatever. Can, yeah. yeah, I can't, whatever. Uh, funny enough, I had an opportunity to make this uh, and return my own kaiju to my hand, but I forgot. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, you know, it happens. Uh, but no, the extra, the only thing that I would change is that Galate had the three. Okay. Because uh, every now and then I see it that I need that third Galate. It's... Oh, that's right. That and then sense. it happens, right? Uh, all right. And then for the side, we got uh, three Kaijus. Uh, doesn't matter what Kaiju. Yeah. It's just Kaijus. It does what it's supposed to do. Uh, three evenly. Just uh, format tax. It does what it does, exactly. Uh, yep. Dark Rulers. Uh, just literally just board breakers. Nip Nips, yep. And 
the newly the added newly to added to two the pink pink uh, i think that there's one card missing here uh so it can be any 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 board breaker when you would side to go first you just never sided anything i don't side to go first oh so for, you're that, that's how confident you are with me that, yeah that's crazy the, 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 there is no need what why like like if i side something if i really if i'm really really scared i would side a kaiju okay that's fair. like just for insurance that like uh okay they don't break my board or they break my board and then I, I can reset it yeah but what if they have a negate ah eh, screw that here okay right that's, that's the right. only thing that i would side in and when i side the thing that i side the most the more the most often is uh one right one enchantress and Depending on why I'm what I'm going. If yeah, I'm going first, first I side out the illegal knight. If I'm going oh, no. second, I side out the the, the Griffin. Griffin Rider. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah. Okay, yo, thank you for the deck profile. Nah, man, anytime. Forty three in the main deck, and then Orcus Horus Adventure. Yeah. No gear suit. If you guys don't have, you know what's funny? You were talking about gear suit getting expensive, and then you're playing three M Seti. Yeah, but I had a I had a what do you call it? A Chaos Angel gathering dust at home, so I'm like, I told my buddy, hey, you want this? Oh, that's fair. And he had him steady, he had C3 and three of the other I one. I made a deal. Made a deal. Made a quick deal. Okay, yeah. thank you, Victor, for the deck profile. No problem. Congratulations again on all the. Uh, so you topped last week, you came second last week, and then you topped this Friday week as well. And I topped this time, yeah. Yeah, yeah, so back to back with Orcus, the uh, Horus yeah. Adventure. So It's solid. It's, it's solid. solid. If, you guys, if you guys want to see the feature match, I know a lot of people are always going to ask, how does this deck play? How do you combo with it? Uh, Spanko Duels, there is a feature match showing off how this deck actually plays, so you guys can get more information on that. Uh, again, to Victor, thank you so much. Subscribe. Make sure you guys like and subscribe, just like Victor said. And with that, Spanko and Victor signing out. Peace. Later.